Jina naitwa Ad Mwathi. Mimi kitu ningetaka kusema ni kushukuru tu wa Kenya juu tumekuwa pamoja kabisa. Nimewashukuru sana kabisa wa Kenya, especially hata wenye wako nje US na wenye wako Middle East. Wamekuwa pamoja na mimi kabisa, wamenitumia message, wameniongelesha, wamenipea courage. So nawarudishia shukrani sana na Mungu awabariki. That is it mtoto wetu tumeumia tumelia tumehangaika but tunaamini kuna Mungu juu mbinguni. Yeah. Ah, uh, Kenya ningetaka ningetaka government ichukulie kila mtu akifanya makosa achukuliwe hatua. Hiyo ndio mimi nataka kusema. Sina mambo mengi. Circumstances of the death was horrid. It is one of the most colors types of murder that has ever occurred in this country for a young man, a youth of that. But we are determined as the defense team for the family, we will keep this matter alive in the public domain and will be calling upon the whole country to rally behind the agenda of getting the heinous murder either one or two or three that participated or planned the death of that young man in this matter as you can see we were the team that i'm here with we were in shakahola i had to come in today in the morning to deal with this matter on a pro bono basis because i feel the pain of a young child, a young son to this mother being murdered and the state is raising up hands and saying we are unable to identify who has murdered this brilliant young man who was a student at Nibs College. He could have grown to be the best lawyer later in life or a serious professional this country. So that is the end unless there are any questions about what transpired in court. Once we get the statements we'll be able to address the content of those statements.